Yes, I'm writing another story about a gravel parking lot. This one, on the face of it, should be simple. The Cates Group and the city built an arena. That arena comes with a large parking lot underneath a large tower. But large towers take time to build, and so the parking lot isn't ready yet. To the north, the Cates Group has a vacant lot that could be used for parking. It's being used for parking now, so the Cates Group has applied to temporarily rezone it. But nothing is ever simple with the arena. The arena deal was one of the most divisive topics in recent Edmonton history. There are still people out there who think, rightly or wrongly, that Edmonton got hosed. And if Cates needed this parking, why didn't he bring it up then? There's been some negotiation. The area is smaller than originally proposed, and it's for a shorter time period. He wanted 10 years originally, now it's three, plus an option to renew for another three years if construction has already started. He also needs to provide $150,000 to the Community League for a local amenity to offset the negative impact of parking. And he'll be putting in proper landscaping and lighting, which is more than most illegal lots downtown have. See, no one argues that surface parking is the best use of that land, and the Cates Group says it's going to redevelop it with mixed residential as fast as possible. So what do you think? I talked to local councillor Scott McKean about this. He's undecided and he thinks it could be a very interesting debate when this goes to council December 12th.